Hey everybody, real quick, show me, I got the Spark and Go Dio. Uh, this one actually is going to a friend of mine, and it is in hand. Now it is in box. <laughs> and this one is mine. I want to do a small little coverage, uh, just showing what it is. As far as scale goes, it's its own scale, forget about it. It's about four and a half inches tall. Yeah, about four and a half inches tall. It sparks up. Let me see. I don't have a little. Can you see? Can I see anything? Else? Yeah, it sparks up. When you really get it going good, it looks pretty good. <laughs> when I mean, when you're on the floor on the table and it goes, and you just have a real good throw on it, it's pretty good. Okay, four and a half inches tall. The head goes left and right. And, yeah, the detailing is, well, it's nowhere near movie accurate, but it's good. The detailing is good. See little wheels on back. Bigger wheels on front. That's the sparky, sparky stuff going on. Let's see here. Okay, once you, like I said, when you get it going good, it does pretty good. But I got it in hand. Okay, just to scale. Here is just to give you an idea, right? This is the 12 inch scale BB 8. Okay, so he's bigger than the 12 inch scale. Or maybe, what do you know? What do you, what is that? I mentioned the toy spoiler earlier. This might be, no, no more, no more, no more. No toy spoiler. <laughs> I had to special order this because no one in my area. Is stocking them as of like four or five days ago. Maybe they came in. I don't know. I just they didn't have them at the time, so I went ahead and ordered them online. And here he is. I think it's pretty cool. It's pretty. It look definitely looks cool. Doesn't make any noises other than the mecha mechanism in there, but it's all right. So, and these things they kind of just they don't move around too much they're rubbery coated but they do kind of vibrate as he goes along you know they're not in there real stiff they do kind of wobble a little bit just a little bit just a little bit okay well this is the spark and go let me show you what the box looks like of course everybody knows what the box looks like but nobody knows how big this thing is Unless you've already got it. It's not very big. Four and a half inches tall and some of that's antenna. So, there it is. Spark and Go BB-8. I got I got it and my buddy has got his now too. It's in the bag. Technically, it's a box. So, yeah. The people I ordered from, the online place, it was Kohl's. Okay. Kohl's has them. Standard price. But they shipped them in a bag. I'm like, oh, come on, have some class coals. Put them in a box. They're already in boxes. This is not like a pillow or something. This is something that, well, whatever. Don't send these things bouncing around in a giant plastic bag. Come on. People want their stuff to get to them in good shape. Both boxes got a little bit damaged, okay? Because it was in a giant unpadded bag. Just a plastic bag, like a garbage bag, but you know the mail bags. And both boxes got got a little bit beat up. So just just that. And I wasn't real happy with that aspect, but I do like the toy itself. It's cool. It looks it looks fun, you know, and it is fun. I went took it in the kitchen floor and it was pretty fun. It likes to it's weird. It likes to go on one wheel, and then it'll tip over and just kind of stay on one wheel on both sides. At least it's even, you know? <laughs> maybe maybe if I add a little bit of weight to the front of it, that would help it stay a little bit better. But it kind of goes on one wheel, goes that way, goes on one wheel, goes that way, and then falls over. <laughs> but it's still fun. I like it. Okay, that's it. Thanks. Uh, just want to show you what this is, and Pete's in the bag, in the box. 
on its way ASAP. Thanks. Out of here. Bye-bye.